<laughs> Welcome back to our channel. Um, I'm Serena and this is the Falco family where homeschool is life and having a teachable spirit is our number one goal. So today, um, we're working our way through our school day as best we can. Savannah is not feeling so great. So mommy's being um, mommy nurse right now. And I thought it would be a good time to just kind of sit down and chit chat with you about um, how we use essential oils in our home and our homeschool. I just got a an order in and I thought I'd just kind of sit down and show you what we use and how we use it. We started using essential oils a few years ago when my husband Brian um, lost his job. Um, my kids were, we were in the doctor quite a bit for most of what is just a lot of cold and flu type things. and. Um, uh, with an occasional like reactive airway breathing issue tummy issues that type of stuff um, But I felt like we were there like every other week basically when he lost his job um, I came across the essential oils and I was like, I don't know something said just try it I believe it was always spirit, but you know what I'm trying to say so I went ahead and ordered a kit and long story short they have been a must-have in our household ever since then um, that entire year I did not have to take the kids to a sick visit not once um, and it was amazing and throughout that time we use it I've you know just trial and error using different things finding out what works best for us so I'm just gonna show you what I got in my haul and also some of the things that we use on a regular basis throughout just the regular you know and throughout our home and in our homeschool days. So first I figured I would start with like my all time favorite four. Like I have to have these four. <laughs> um, I have a quite I have a bigger, a slightly bigger haul this time around, but most of the time I stick to reordering these four for sure because they can get kind of pricey, but it is a balance because at the end of the day, you spend money um, taking your kids to doctor's visits. So why not pay ahead of time as long as you can? That's how I feel in my household. Um, so I'll start with those four. Those four are an oil blend called um, On Guard. I use doTERRA oils. I know two of the bigger um, brands of oils are Young Living and doTERRA. Um, I came across doTERRA because there was a girl that I followed on Instagram that I really liked and trusted um, and I've stuck with that brand ever since because I'm pretty brand loyal around here. Um, the first one that I got is an oil blend called um, On Guard. It's their immunity blend, so it has clove and a bunch of other goodies in it. Um, and that is the one we probably use the most. And then the other three that make up my Fab Four um, are tea tree oil, which is melaleuca, um, eucalyptus, and peppermint. So I'll flip this around so I can show you what I got. So this is the protective blend On Guard. We love this stuff. I use it um, to brush our teeth. Um, and like I said, just for everyday immunity, um, this one is a must have for me. Melaleuca, which is a tea tree oil. And um, this has antiviral and antibacterial properties. Eucalyptus, I pretty much always have this on repeat. Um, in our diffuser because it is great for keeping that congestion at bay. And peppermint is just my jam. <laughs> this one might be my all time favorite just because it smells so good, it smells like peppermint. And um, it's great for when you're trying to get used to the smells of the oils. So I'm pretty sensitive when it comes to my nose and the smells and things. So when I first got the oils and first started using them I did get quite a bit of headaches because I'm just not used to such um, you know just strong scents but eventually I got used to it but peppermint is definitely the one that helped me kind of get used to a lot of the different smells next up I have frankincense so I actually got this in the welcome kit when I first started using oils it was a smaller bottle um, a 5 ml bottle of frankincense um, so I just used it until it was gone really didn't have a rhyme or reason for how to use it it is a pricier oil so uh, when I placed my last order it was actually part of the um, incentive for that month and so I got this 50 ml bottle for um, free the next one I got was turmeric so 
I heard that turmeric is good for a lot of different things. Um, digestive health is one of them. Um, boosting your immune system is um, one of them. So uh, this is going to be my first time using this. So I'm just going to try a few different things out that I had in mind and see how it goes. Serenity is one that I use quite a bit. It's a calming blend. So um, I tend to diffuse it um, throughout the morning, especially when I'm hitting around lunchtime when I'm generally losing them and myself <laughs> to help us just kind of calm that energy down and digest sin is amazing we really like this oil blend it is really helpful when they have just little tummy aches or are having trouble um, with their bowels and things or if they have you know just any digestive issues I have had much success with this oil I got clove this time around which is really great for um, some focusing effects and it is awesome for us to use um, for our oral health so inside of our toothpaste and things that's how we use that rosemary is a new one this time around I absolutely love rosemary and I looked up some of its benefits so I'm excited to try this one out a bit um, I think I have this one planned for a a focus blend as well someone's feeling better <laughs> so I also have this one vet fur this is great for focus and I'm just going to list all the different blends that I use and um, what they help and what they help us with really good for sleep cedar wood it has a very strong smell and so this one is one of those that I use with peppermint um, to help me just kind of deal with the smell a little bit better oregano is one of my flu busters it's like another one of those antiviral antibacterial things um, this one goes a very long way I've had this one for quite some time I only use like a drop of it when I diffuse it because it is such a strong smell and anytime I add it to like a roller ball to use on their skin um, this is one of those you definitely want to have a ton of carrier oil with or else it will irritate your skin to no end it'll actually burn so um, this one will go a very very long way lemongrass I meant to grab the lemon um, but I also use lemongrass as well but this is really good for focus and concentration um, and waking them up in the morning this one I got as one of my bonus um, blends I haven't used it just yet so I want to give it a try it's an uplifting blend I'm actually gonna roll it on today because I'm feeling a little bit low um, mainly due to, to the fact that it is pouring outside and it's also super gloomy it is so dark right now so I pretty much have on deck all the time I have these um, blue roller balls I think I have about six of them I need to make up new ones um, to just add different blends for me to they're just really easy um, to add the different blends of oils that I want including the carrier oil and then use this throughout the day with the kids um, these two are my go-to's for tummy aches the digestion and the on guard for just basic immunity this actually has more than on guard in it it has a few other things it's kind of like my cold and flu buster right here so um, these are my two go-to's that I use all the time now I'm just going to show you some of the blends that I use throughout the days I don't use these every day um, I use them when I feel like they're really necessary um, like focus blends and things I use mostly on math days so um, I, I just kind of try to go through how I use it but um, basically this one is my learn blend this is just my general everyday get excited about learning type of blend um, I have rosemary lemongrass which is normally just lemon peppermint and then frankincense I don't always use this because I don't always have this frankincense but now that I have it I'm definitely adding it to the mix so this is just gonna be my general let's get ready let's learn blend this is my concentration blend so this is the one that I go to when we need to concentrate on building or um, math solving problems and things like that this is something I like to pull out for that time period again this one is normally replaced with just lemon but if I can't find a lemon I use the lemongrass the serenity is a calming blend so it's kind of like I calm them down and um, help them to focus this vetiver I'm trying to like really um, be more consistent with using that one because that one is supposed to be really um, 
good for the nervous system. I like to do a lemon slash peppermint in the morning. Um, I also have a wild orange that I'll use. Anything citrusy in the morning. So a citrus oil and then a little bit of peppermint really helps to wake them up and get them going. This is definitely something we need in our household because we are kind of like a lazy morning type of homeschool family, which I really like, but <laughs> we also have to do better, you know, just kind of doing whatever we need to do to get up in the morning. The bedtime deal, just kind of immunity support, good sleep at night. I don't have the lavender in here, but I'll add that into the mix as well, just for some good, nice, you know, REM type of sleep and to keep the sickies away. Now on actual sick days, days where I need like a serious boost, I'm sticking with the On Guard and the Melaleuca, of course and the peppermint of course but then i'm going to add in some oregano some frankincense now that i have it for sure and some eucalyptus so we just want to make sure that they lose the congestion as quickly as possible clear the nasal passages so that nothing kind of builds up in that space something to just kind of soothe them and keep them you know feeling like they're being well taken care of the peppermint is great for keeping their temperature down um yeah and so this is what i use this is like my flu buster situation um and it works really really well so that is what we use mostly in our home and in our homeschool with essential oils. They have been so helpful to us in our health and our homeschool and focusing and all that other stuff. Um, the thing that you need the most is to make sure that you're using oils consistently. Um, I don't use all of these things. I don't, I'm not using all of these things every day. Um, a lot of times it's basically whatever I can grab a hold of. What's really helpful for me though is to have roller balls that are prepared ahead of time so I can just grab a roller ball and roll it on the back of their necks, the back of their ears, um, on the, um, wrist on their wrist and on the bottom of their feet and so that's normally easy they know the drill a lot of the times they'll get them themselves um, because these are diluted with the carrier oil so they're pretty safe they're pretty safe for them to be able to administer themselves and um, then I just try to have like an, a little alarm on I definitely make sure to keep them rolling on math days because math just requires a lot of extra concentration and focus, especially for mommy as well. Um, but yeah, I've been getting a, a few notifications that you, some people are missing some of my uploads. You can fix that by clicking the little bell button that will notify you every time we post. So if that's a problem that you're having, you might want to give that a try. Make sure you are subscribed. Um, like this video if you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next video.